Welcome friends to our YouTube learning channel. Accurate. ASME. ISO. In this video let us discuss on CMM probe heads. MH20I vs MH8. Please do not forget to subscribe and like it. Let's begin now. The probing system comprises of probe head, probe, and stylus. All together is called a probing system. TP20 probe is of two parts. A probe body and a module. Both are attached together with permanent magnet. The operation of MH20I is very easy and user friendly. Probe head works as an indexing head. Any engineering part is having different faces as like cubical shapes. To probe the features at different orientation, probe also need to orient. Probe head indexing facilitates to rotate and tilt probe in given direction. A manual knob is used to unlock and lock the position. After unlock by hand, user adjust the orientation. By locking the knob the defined position get firmly locked. The angular scale marked horizontally and vertically, guide to reach or retain the set angular position. Head that combines the TP20 kinematic stylus module mount with two axis indexing, enabling flexible stylus changing and repeatable probe reorientation. The B axis rotates through plus or minus 180 degree in the XY plane. The A axis rotates through 90 degrees in the Z plane. A lever locks the head in one of up to 168 repeatable positions, set at 15 degrees increments. The head is capable of carrying the full range of TP20 modules, which can be changed without requalification. MH20I probe head is inbuilt with TP20 probe body. Externally TP20 cannot be attached. Only TP20 module is magnetically attached to the probe head. Attach of probe module is possible with auto changing rack as well as by hand. A axis indexing. 0 degree to 90 degrees in 15 degrees repeatable steps. B axis indexing 180 degrees in 15 degrees repeatable steps repeatability of position 1.5 micrometers TP20 and 10 millimeters stylus fitted 2.5 micrometers M2 extended module and 10 millimeters stylus maximum extension bar M2 extension module, 75 mm. A major difference between MH20I and MH8 probe head are, MH20I has got inbuilt TP20 probe body, and MH8 probe required, externally fitted TP20 body, 
with M8 threading. A axis indexing. 0 degree to 90 degrees in 15 degrees repeatable steps is equal to 7 positions. B axis indexing. Plus or minus 180 degree in 15 degrees repeatable steps is equal to 24 positions. Repeatability of position. 1.5 micrometer TP2 and 10 millimeters stylus fitted. Maximum extension bar. 50 millimeters. PL1 only. In CNC run of program, wherever probe need to change orientation, machine programmed to stop at safe zone. A user unlock and select desired indexing angle, followed with firm locking of the head. To continue the CNC program, a dialog box is cleared on the software screen. By click or press the key, program is continued. Hope that, you have liked this video, with very easy and simple explanations. You can comment how do you see this initiative and suggest more on upcoming videos. Also we are pleased to conduct training programs at your locations in factories. We offer Occam Germany, an international CMM certification course. Basic of GDNT. Advanced GDNT. Stack up tolerances. Surface finish. MSA and other quality tools. For further details, please contact us. And I'm sure you will encourage the initiative of training through YouTube, by subscribing a channel. Accurate, ASME, ISO. Thank you and have a good day.